All right, folks, welcome back, and this is Drone 2 Robotics. And today, I'm going to be reviewing the Walker's Fire Max Rechargeable Digital Earmuffs. See? They're for, like, the shooting range. Um, you can get radio add-ons, which is what I've got here. The Fire Max uh, walkie-talkies. Uh, so, yes, I'm going to be reviewing both of these today, so stay tuned. We're going to go into previews, and I shall be right back. Welcome back, and like I said, we are going to be reviewing the Walker's FireMax Digital Rechargeable Earmuffs and the Walker's FireMax Walkie Talkie. These ones they are sold separately. These earmuffs over here are under $70. Right now they're on sale though. And uh, the Walker's are $22. Um, the Walkie Talkie, I think they're roughly around $22, so it's under $100 if you want to get both of these, and they are on sale right now so uh, I guess I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing out of the package so yeah <clears throat> Alright folks, so the digital walkers earmuffs right now are charging. I did not get any information anywhere on how long it takes to charge, so I guess we're going to go ahead and review this until those are done charging, then I'm going to test them out and show you guys, uh, we'll actually test out the range and show you guys what some of the buttons and settings does. So yeah, let's go ahead and get this uh, radio out of the package. Aha. All right, folks, welcome back. And I'm not exactly sure how long it took to charge. Apologies there. And so let's get right on with the review. All right, so starting off with the review, can I move that over there? We've got a one-year limited warranty right here. Setting that over there. The instructions for the earmuffs and the radio instructions and the USB, uh, and the uh, charging cable right here for it. Setting that over there. And the digital earmuffs and the FireMax walkie-talkie. So let's start with the FireMax or the uh, Walker's FireMax rechargeable digital earmuffs. And these earmuffs feel like really good quality. Um, 2000 mega amp hour, milliamp hour, something like that uh, battery inside them. Supposedly 200 hours of uh, battery use. Not sure if I believe that though. So here's where the sound comes in here and here. And these two are sold separately. Um, the volume for the earmuffs up and down. Um, your power and your modes button. Um, okay, and these for whenever you're at the shooting range or something, there's a loud noise or something, you can just clap your hands or, you know, guns going off. Um, it'll immediately, automatically quiet it down, just like kill all the sound. For you which is really cool and then once the shooting is stopped the sound uh, returns which is really cool 
So let's go ahead and get the radio into this thing. And gotta pop that cap off. I had to take this cap out right here. Uh, ugh, what do you know? GoPro's camera is about dead. I'm just gonna go ahead and snap this in there. Okay. And again, the camera's pretty much dead, folks. So um, I'm gonna get a new battery and I'll be right back. Sorry about that. Battery ran out. So back on with the review. So what do the buttons do here? This is your transmitter button right here at the bottom. Your uh, volume buttons for the radio, your volume buttons for the earmuffs, your power, and your mode button. So let's go ahead and turn the power button on. Get you back into the little darker light here so you can see it when it lights up. Hold it for about three seconds, and there you go. Uh, starts off at channel one, um, battery level full, and brain bars or something like that. Uh, I'm not sure what that is exactly, but uh, okay. So uh, I'm gonna give you my ending, re uh, ending review part here. I've had previous ones like this, so I kind of know a little bit about them. And half mile range, like I said, through the uh, down a hill and through the woods. And what else? So these are, do believe, are some extent water resistant. And also, these are really good listening device type things because you can hear like crazy well with these things. And these, it doesn't look like it's. Um, yeah, because this doesn't stick out very far. But uh, you can actually hear people when they're talking to you, like, really, really well. So, uh, yeah, so I guess that is pretty much it. The only complaints I have on this is it's a tad bit difficult to get the radio on and off. But uh, this does way better than I thought it would. Also, these earmuffs are really good for four-wheeler riding. Me and my brother were on them, and that's when we got to test out the half-mile range, and you can still hear crystal clear. I personally really, really like them for four-wheeler riding. So, I guess that pretty much sums up the review. So, I guess we're going to go ahead and go into the outro. All right, folks. So, if you guys are interested in this product, they're on sale right now at Midway USA. Just type that into your browser. And if you guys have any questions, just leave them in the comment section down below, and I'll do my best to answer them. Also, if you guys want to see more videos like this one, just hit the subscribe button on Drone2 Robotics. So, I guess until next time, over and out. All right, folks, so here's a little bit of trick flying. Shoot!